if there was one thing that I would want to, that I know now that I probably didn't know at the start of the pandemic, um, that would change what I would do, um, I guess the main thing would be the duration that it was going to last for. Um, obviously, when we first started back in March 2020 now, um, the idea would be that by a certain point, this would be back and done and we'd just be back to, to normal by a certain point. And therefore, I guess what we did was we filled the gap and we filled the gap by using lots of um, revisiting and um, trying to re-strengthen the sort of any lost learning that had gone before, really. And we spent a lot of time, I guess, treading water because we sort of felt like, well, this was a short period of time and you don't want to start something new because when we do return to the classroom, there'll be a there'll be an easier way to do it or a better way to do it, or we'll be able to be more comfortable with the way that we're doing. I guess now that we sit here in January 2021, still in a similar situation, the duration, if we would have known at the start, would have made a real difference to what we're doing. When we returned in September, we said we're moving forward and we're learning, we're, we're getting through the curriculum and we're going to get these students to where we want them to be. When we then effectively closed again or, or sort of closed the site in, in January, we didn't say we're going to tread water again because we realized that this is going to be an ongoing and a long process. So what we've done from that point is simply just said we move forward. Uh, we've planned schemes of work and, and sequenced work to allow us to teach forward. And although I guess we would all say that as teachers being in a classroom and having that face to face interaction is often the most successful type of learning that we can do we know that we're giving a really good product to the students where even if it's only 70% successful or 50% successful, we know that they're moving forward rather than just staying still in their education. So I would say if there was one thing that I wish I knew in March was the duration. And therefore, if I knew that in March, we would, I think, have moved forward at a faster rate in March with our learning rather than probably treading water, as I say.